Okay, buddy bud. Got another short one for you. <clears throat> Pardon me. Alabama police search for woman who vanished from bar with two men. Texted friend, I feel in trouble. Hmm. Wonder why. Let's see what she looks like here. <sighs> two men, huh? A 29-year-old woman is missing after she was last seen leaving an Alabama bar with two strangers. According to Alabama.com, police said uh, was last seen Friday night at Tin Roof in the Lakeview District of Birmingham with two men. The official said she left with them willingly. Hmm. I guess she left all the nice guys at the bar. <laughs> and her, uh, they also say her bank account has not been accessed in over 24 hours and her phone is going directly to voicemail. Does not sound good at all. I, I hope she's found okay, but uh, I have to be honest here and say left with two guys. Why do they go to the bar to pick up guys? Shirley, how old is she? 29. Shirley. No, don't call me Shirley. Oh, uh, she knew the risks. Had to have. I mean, even I would, I wouldn't leave a, a bar with two guys myself. Or even, I, I want to know them a little bit. I, I can't, you know, especially nowadays. It's just too dangerous. Uh, let's see what people are saying here. A uh, single lady goes into a bar at night. The bar is in Alabama. That doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what, whether it's in Alabama. Uh, she leaves the bar with two men, strangers. And for some undetermined reason, the lady, lady later sends a text message uh, indicating she feels in trouble. What could go wrong with two strangers that you just met, met in a bar? It doesn't matter if it's Alabama or anywhere. That, that's, that's, uh, that shouldn't be in there. At night, you know, uh, at age 29, she should have been well aware of the risk of leaving with not even one, but two men she didn't know. Yes, alcohol and possibly other substances can impair judgment. But she was sober enough to text. How do you know she was sober enough to text a friend? So she wasn't incapacitated. <laughs> people go to bars to meet people because the alcohol lowers your inhibitions. You know what they say? They look better at closing time. You know, it's been my opinion. You know, if you're not drinking, you're not cool. If you need alcohol to meet somebody, you know, that, I think that's an issue. Uh, what else here? I haven't read out and gone through too many of these. <laughs> I'm not getting into that. Yeah, I wouldn't, uh, even if I, I was, uh, was interested in women, I wouldn't leave it to strange women. I'm not interested in women at all. No penis, no dice is my motto. I'm just being honest. I, I claim to be honest, and I'm being honest. I don't know. I'm trying not to judge on books. She looks familiar, though. She looks like uh, someone that was in one of the episodes of Love It or Love It or List It. Looks just like her. I don't. I'm sure it isn't. But uh, well, anyways, this is my uh, video of the day. I haven't put one out for a little while. Uh. She should have stayed home and masturbated. 
it's cheap, it's free, it's safe, and it's a hell of a lot of fun because you can do whoever you want. Okay, I guess this concludes my little uh, Saturday morning tirade. I <laughs> uh, hope somebody's enjoying my uh, new channel. It, I'm, I'm working on it. My last video, I, I, I've been trying to darken the contrast because the so the screen isn't so bright and it looked horrible so I'm just going to leave it the way it is alright please hit the like button and subscribe I don't have any subscribers or any likes yet at all so I'm really trying uh, like I said I do hope she's found safe I may hate women not interested but I don't want to see anyone get hurt okay that's it for Buddy Bud. I'll catch you next time.